while I anxiously wait for the video to upload for this week. I'm sorry. Uh, things have been kind of hectic. It's not here yesterday. Um, and today is just uh, crazy. Um, but um, we're going to preview. Well, actually, we're going to talk about these NFL games that happen on, well, this week. Um, first off, let's just start with the game that just um, ended yesterday. The, um, the Monday night game yesterday was a it was bad. It was really bad. The Eagles come back to beat the Giants 23 to 17 in overtime. Um, Eagles are decimated right now. They have basically no players, but they stepped up and they got the W. Now the Eagles are tied with Cowboys, who miserably lost to the Bears. Just a disgusting performance. Um, J- Jason Garrett is he, he, he's definitely gone after the season. Um, there's no hope for Jason. I'm sorry. He's just lost this team. He's lost everything. And it's disappointing as a fan of the Cowboys to see this team like this. Just absolute garbage. Um, The Rams easily dispatched the Seahawks. Like, where did this come from? Yeah, sure, Jared Goff threw two picks. But the Rams dominated the Seahawks the entire game on Sunday night. And, you know, it was crazy. The Steelers have bounced all the way back, they are in the playoff hunt. They are still in the playoff picture, and they beat the Cardinals 23-17. to Remember when the Steelers' season was lost? Remember when I said that? Remember when everybody wrote off the Steelers? The Steelers are back in business with Duck Hodges, at quarterback. Um, the Raiders, they're looking like they're getting close to coming out of the playoff race. They have lost several games in a row now. Titans, just Ryan Tannehill went ahead and clapped him cheeks in the second half. 21 unanswered, I believe, in the second half for the for the Titans. What in the world happened to the Raiders? We thought they were going to be something, but now they're looking like they're nothing. The Chiefs beat the Patriots. Um, yeah, there was some rep ball in this game. It was a lot of rep ball, but ultimately the Chiefs got the victory. Um, I mean, it, it is what it is. The Chiefs did just enough. They are still in the race. Uh, Well, I think they locked up the AFC West, basically. Three weeks left to go and whatnot. Chargers destroyed the Jags, but this game really doesn't matter, to be completely honest. Um, Dolphins, Jets. Jets get a game-winning field goal. Falcons defeat the Panthers by 20, and the Panthers are out of the playoff hunt um, for good. Um Bengals Browns. I know the Bengals and Browns fans. You know they're they're having a disappointing type season, uh, but you know the Browns got the victory. Odell's mad. Does he want to be in Cleveland? I don't know. I don't think so. Um, Broncos surprisingly just dominated the Texans for the entire game. Yeah, the Texans got some garbage points late. Thirty-eight twenty-four was the final there, but yeah, uh, um, Redskins. They are out of the playoff hunt as well. They lose to the Packers 20-15. to um, Ravens beat the Bills 24-17. The game was basically locked up by the beginning of the fourth quarter. Um, Lamar Jackson continues to do things that are just absolutely awesome on the field. Um, Vikings beat the Lions 20-7. Really doesn't matter right there, that game there. Uh, Bucks, yeah, sure, the Bucks won, but ultimately... It didn't matter. The Bucks are eliminated from the playoffs. <laughs> oh, man. But lastly, the game of the week, I think, the game of the year, similar to the game we got last year with the with the Chiefs and, and on the Rams, we had a barn burner down in New Orleans. And, oh, my goodness, Jimmy G, George Kittle, all those 49ers receivers were out there balling. Debo Samuel, too, you know. It was great going up against the great Drew Brees. And it was such a fun, fun game. We need to see this again in the playoffs. We need to see it. I am so excited. Um, but, yeah, the 49ers won at the very end, 48-46, like a couple of lead changes in the final minute. It was great. Oh, my goodness. But, yeah, that's what... We're getting close to the finish line, boys. 
14 weeks have come and gone in the NFL. Three left. Playoffs are right around the corner. And I'm ready to go on the journey with y'all. So that's going to do it for this video. And we'll talk to you guys in a few with the Week 15 preview. And, yeah, let's go. Y'all take care.